Hey there, cats and kittens. So you're planning to go see a midnight showing of Zorro in one of the most dangerous parts of town, and you're going to wear some nice pearls. Yeah, that's a good idea. Speaking of tragic nights, this week's comic book of the week is Batman The Dark Knight Zero, a DC Comics comic. Greg Hurwitz is the writer with Miko Swayan and Juan Jose Ripe on pencils. Cover provided by Finch with Obak. This is a retelling of the tragic night that put Bruce Wayne on the road to being Batman. What makes this story unique is the seamless melding of wonderful art and a unique take on a familiar story. Let's start with the art. Well, the draftsmanship is clearly professional and of superior quality. I thought the artist did a fantastic job with catching nuances in facial expressions. It had kind of a realistic feel to it without being photorealistic. Seeing Bruce Wayne driven and obsessed and looking for the big pictures and seeing patterns all over the place, patterns that would pay off later in his life, was great. And I liked the meticulous attention to detail in the story. There was nothing cliche or shocking in this retelling of the story, but rather some different vantages and some different perspectives, which I thought were wonderful. So if you're a Batman fan and you want to see this classic story and confrontation with Joe Chill told in a way that makes you think, no, I could see that happening in the world, then I recommend this story greatly. I think you're going to enjoy it a lot and this creative crew has a lot to be proud of. All right, guys, that's all for now. Please remember to rate, comment, subscribe, and pin me to your homepage. I hope you're having an amazing day, and I look forward to talking to you very soon. Bye.